Thanks for staying with us. The House of Representatives at her committee probing the utilization of ecological funds has frowned at the alleged mismanagement of funds appropriated to the National Agency for the Great, uh, Great Green Wall. This came a day the panel investigating accruals from the National Housing Fund summoned chief executives of insurance companies for allegedly violating the act. National Assembly correspondent Jokia Desai reports. Creation of the National Agency for the Great Green Wall by an act of the Parliament in 2015 was to tackle desertification and land degradation across the country. It was established to be at the forefront of winning the war against this menace in line with the United Nations Convention on Combating Desertification. But allegations of fraud and worsening land degradation have led to this gathering. The chief executive officer of the agency tells the lawmakers how the agency has drifted from its constitutional responsibilities, including using staggering amounts of money to plant trees. The agency, but not the DG. The DG has never seen or was responsible for spending 81 billion. No, that, that I'm not going to admit. And uh, agencies like UNEP, AAD, and others, they fund in USDs. Then they, you find the way of reaching you through CBN. It is not admitting whether or not we have a DOM account. As far as I'm concerned, we've submitted everything that shows the accounts that we're in. That I cannot agree, uh, Honorable Chairman, sir. No. Apparently dissatisfied with the submissions of the agency, the committee says the chief executive must reappear to throw more light on gray areas. Are you the person that planted all those uh, 21 million trees? You could not answer that question. Now, I want you to just make a brief uh, uh, remark on these supplies and livelihood and training. Running into, they have given me figures, into billions of Naira from what has been released to you. You understand? That's why they have been asking you, tell them the percentage of amount put into the main purpose of establishing this agency and the one that you deviated, the agency deviated and spent. They want to know the difference. The mandate of the agency starts from page one. Yeah. On page two, 3.0, I hold a PhD. Mr. DG, you told us work plan. The work plan simply means is what you, the agency, sat down to give to yourself. And in giving to yourself, you are busy buying spaghetti, buying sugar, and you told us that you are restoring livelihoods. You are busy constructing tanks of uh, maybe five, five meters or three meters for 19 million naira. So you deviated from the core mandate given to you, and you are busy with enlightenment, which you spent uh, well over, is it 500 million or thereabout? Enlighten my uh, old grandfather in the village. The Dutch of Bagos Committee probing non remittance to the National Housing Fund says it has uncovered a 267 billion naira debt owed by insurance companies in 2019 alone. Section 5, subsection 2 of the National Housing Fund Act provides that every registered insurance company shall invest a minimum of 20% of its non-life funds and 40% of its life funds in real property development, of which not less than 50% shall be paid into the fund through the Federal Mortgage Bank of Nigeria at an interest rate not exceeding 4%. The committee chairman says the insurance companies failed to pay about 267 billion naira to the Federal Mortgage Bank of Nigeria being their statutory investment in the National Housing Fund. The absence of the chief executives of the insurance companies didn't go down well with the committee. So to the insurance companies, you need to tell us where is over 236 billion that is that you are supposed to have remitted into the national to the Nigerian Housing Fund, to the NHL Fund. Your chief executives must appear for themselves. Federal Mortgage Bank, you must show us proof that you have demanded for this money. The panel insists on the fiscal appearance of the chief executives of the insurance companies as it warns against disregard for parliamentary summons. Chokayadza, TVC News, Abuja. Tuesday.